up, you awesome and amazing cinches? It's your boy. Oh, yeah. Johnny Two Chuff. And what I have for you guys today, oops, what I have for you guys today is another episode of The Greatest Warrior. Of all time in Minecraft. Yeah, do you like Minecraft? Who like Minecraft? No, but what I'm going to be doing with you guys today is we are going to be exploring. For a lot of you guys, you know exactly what we have been doing. For some of you guys, you're new. But I have new things I love to show you. And out here is one of them. We have our farm. I can't quite remember if I showed you, but you know what? It's coming along. So if I did show you the farm, now what I'm showing you is that it's coming along. Now, you see all this growth and beauty? We don't need it anymore. And I'll explain to you why in just a second why we don't need it. But I have been putting this beautiful, 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 beautiful tinker's table to or tinker's drain smeltery, whatever you want to call it. To work this thing has been getting me so much done now you're gonna notice one thing you're gonna notice something that's kind of bad kind of really bad i don't have my armors on and i'm probably gonna die but one of the things that you're going to notice that is good and bad is that i lost three hearts that is probably one of the scariest things that have happened to me in the efforts of getting this tool and testing it um i came up here to grab something zombies spawned down there in that hole and they attacked me now there's also an area in our fence where they can get in which kind of sucks too and it's not here did you know that a zombie can take that too all right so we're going to have to make something called a prayer i have never done it before but i'm so excited because i hear the legend that holds this is that if i make a prayer of notch which is paper lapis lazuli and ink sack I will be able to pray and gain regain hearts because I don't have golden apples. I do have uh, enough, so if we do get an apple, um, I could probably perhaps make an apple. I don't know. It, it, it's it's neither here nor there. I'm gonna have to waste a little bit. But before we go, oh, I also had enough tools to make an uh, pickaxe. I know that was something else that we were trying to get to as well. So you're going to notice I have stencils now. Um, I was able to make the casts for some items as well. So now if I ever need a new pickaxe or a hammer of any type, I can now produce it. Because with the pickaxe, you only need the binding as well as the pickaxe head. And then the rest of it is just uh, default stuff. So now we have ourselves good old-fashioned iron pick. And I was able to get a chest plate, and that's why I made that one section. So now if I ever need to rebuild a chest plate or do anything like that we're in perfect shape we've been doing what we gotta do folks we've been doing it real big yeah we were like yo i want to do it real big because i love this game but i said that this farm would no longer be needed let me show you guys why i've been doing a lot of work as you can see i'm a i like my jerky so i like to eat myself some jerky we're making a farm down here it's safer and i can produce more supplies faster because i'm gonna have a lot more farms as soon as i extend the walls out this way this way and that way and this is actually in an ocean you can see the sand right there so i have to be extremely careful the mine shaft hasn't changed much you'll notice i have diamonds because i now have an iron pick which allowed me to get to diamonds so i've been progressing well man you know when i came into this game no one knew my name. Now everybody know my name. So I kind of extended there, and I pretty much just came down for diamonds. But like I said, we already have a goal for today, so let's accomplish it. I'll see you guys on the other side, and yeah! Or more or less at the top, but yeah! All right, bros. What we're going to do is we're going to head out, and we're going to try to find some sugar cane. We have three pieces, okay? And everyone and their grandmother's like, Seiko. You got three pieces, you be thankful for what you have. No, I refuse. So I'm actually going to be setting up a little ghetto farm here for my sugar cane. It's only going to be like four or five blocks wide because I don't want it to intrude upon my home. But the reason I'm doing this is because if we need to pray to Notch, which we're going to pray a lot, we're going to be like, Almighty Notch, we love you. Just remember that, BB. And then whenever we need to do that, I need to be able to do that. And one of the prerequisites for being able to do that is having sugar cane. So... I'm going to plant these three pieces, and then we're going to go find some more. Let's go. Let's go find some sugar cane before it gets really dark and scary and not safe at all. All right. I need a sword. I have one. We have some caribou jerky. Uh, what else are we going to need here? If I had any other food, that'd be awesome, but I don't think we're quite in a position to. We have tons of seeds, but that's not really going to help us. Um, I could do one last hoorah with the wheat. I don't really want to pick potatoes yet. Well... 
I'm not even gonna rehydrate it. I just want to get out before it's dark. You know what? We're going on a midnight adventure. Let's see really how bad it. You know what? I don't want to do that. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? Let's go. Yolo. I don't think I'll die. And if I do, worse things have happened to better people. I think I can actually even make one prayer just to be safe. Uh, no, I don't have. Um, I don't have the ink sacks. And that's primarily the reason why we're heading out. Because I need the ink sacks off the cuff. Then everything else will fall into place pretty well. So I don't even mind. I'll wait till it's dark, dark, and I'll head out. I ain't even scared. I have a full set of armor. So if I manage to die, that'd be kind of sad. I may be at low hearts, but I don't see myself actually like, Ah, nah, dead. He's dead. No chance. He done. Bye-bye, Cynico. Or Johnny Too Tough. You ain't got no shot, bro. You're done. You done, sir. You real done. If you any chance you had is gone, friend. No, I don't see that happening, but it could. It could very well happen. I'm very good at farming, mostly because that's how I spent the beginning of my life. I was a farmer, then I got into the royal family and began to do all that other crap. Yep, true story. And I emptied this so I could put this gold in there, and nothing else is in there, so we should be good. And it is absolutely pitch black outside. I wish I could make ham sandwiches, beef jerky with bread. That sounds so disgustingly good right now. In game, obviously, because I would not eat that IRL. That was just so disgusting. I wouldn't be like, yo, dog, I want to eat that because no one in their right mind would. That's just probably one of the most disgusting things ever. Said no one ever because it's amazing. Beef jerky sandwiches. Mm. All right, let's go. Let's get ready to pray to Notch. Um, let's eat. We got to be fully fed. If I have something on me I don't necessarily need, this will be the time to drop it like it's hot, too. I have another fence gate because I had to remake that one. Stupid little zombie came in and actually came onto my territory. All right, let's go. I'm super scared. All right, so far one. We're just going to try to get to the water. There's some sugar cane right there. We're going to try to get to the water as fast as possible because... The faster you can get into the water, I would presume, the faster we can kill some of those dudes. We need to get ourselves some octopus. Hey, buddies. So, I have this thing. I, I need to meet some of you guys because, well, my cousin, he's absolutely obsessed with octopus. And I told him I'd introduce myself. Do you guys fight back? Squid, squid, do you guys fight back? No, you do not. All right. Uh, I need to get to a wall. I need to get to a wall. I need to get to a wall. There we go. Oh, that was close. All right. I think you drowned if I... Yep. 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 What'd you drop? You dropped... <gasps> Squid meat. Oh, my God. I can eat you. Okay. 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 Wall. 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 I'm such a crutch. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, God. I lost more hearts trying to do more good. One more and we're good. One more and we're good, I think. All right. So make sure we always have air. This is an old school getaway of getting air underwater. It's just using a torch. All right. Let's double check how many we have once we make it to the top safe. All right. And we have six. It takes four. I'm going in for this guy. Please drop a little bit extra, buddy. Please, 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 please. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Grab some air. Let's get out of here. And if we need more, there's always, always opportunities. So I'm going to swim around, around the little moat or whatever you want to call it, island we have here. And see if I can locate some sh more sugar cane. Because I think three pieces is good enough for some paper. But you never know. We're in a day and an era where things get very dangerous. People are like, yeah! And you're like, no, don't kill my family. I just want to have fun. So we're going to take damage. That's just a given. And the only way to protect ourselves is by praying. By prayer and meditation. That's the only way we're ever going to save ourselves. So, what's that? Like, stars and... The oh, they're stars! They're shooting stars! I made a wish. I wish that I was... I wish I was fast. Okay, come on. I don't like that. These weaker swords actually have, like, weaker effect. And that kind of makes me sad. I remember the good old days. Let's get back in. Because there are some pretty scary mobs that come out if you're not careful. Alright, so let's go ahead and get all this set up. Let's go ahead and put it all together. I know I, the only reason I'm doing that, the only reason is because we have these growing. Although it may take a billion months. Well, I was like, where's my helmet? It wasn't showing up. It, even though it may take a billion months, we do have it. So I hope the prayer of notch uh, uh, companies for enough of this. Let's go. I can make two prayers. All right, let's go. I'm praying to Notch. I love you, Notchy baby. 
Is this how we pray? Okay. Um. Okay. Um. Oh crap! I don't have full food, 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 food. I'm just guessing now. This is just an assumption. I gotta eat. I've got to eat the. Nope. Still not regenerating. All right. All right. All right. Prayer to Notch. I have to wait seven minutes? I didn't even do anything. I have no clue what happened there. What? What? All right. I don't even know what happened. I wonder if I dry bread if it turns into toast. But whatever. I don't even know what happened there. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and get some mining done. I'll see you guys on the other side in seven minutes. I don't even have a clue what just happened there. And yeah! Uh, whoa! Ah! Ah! Okay, so, ah, ah, what the crap, a brutish, oh god, oh god, alright, well, I took damage down there, so, for those of you guys that don't know, I took damage down there, and now I gotta deal with a brutish zombie, okay, I thought I said British, and he ruined my farm, cool, I took damage while I was at the bottom, but I learned some things, the notch pairs suck, they're absolutely horrible, and, um, I still have to wait, I still have to wait, and people are just destroying everything, so, even in ultra hardcore survival, you're not really ultimately safe. Everything just seems dangerous. Like, you're just never safe. You turn around a corner and bam, you're dead. Bam, bam, dead, dead. So, you just gotta protect yourself, I guess. Protect yourself against the elements. Ooh, mushroom. I already have a mushroom, but now I have multiple. So, I need to create a dark room. Um, let's grab some iron. If I see supplies as I go, for those of you guys wondering what I want to do now is I need a bed. I just need to sleep at night. And I think that would allow more expedition. So I'm going to try to find some sheep. Although hostile, I think it's a better choice for me to try to get some sheep and cheer them as opposed to just going out about and dying a lot. So what I'm going to do is there was also a farm over. Ooh, cows. That's beef. Beefarino. Do you guys know where any sheep are? Yeah? No? Maybe show? All right, let's make the shears now in anticipation of getting ourselves some sheep. I know we'll find them. I have faith in us. But that's basically the way I'm going to set up because I'm just, I'm too terrified. Every time I do something now, it's like, ah, I'm scared. And I, I, if I had sheep, I'd be able to just be comfortable, comfortable. I'd be safe, comfortable. This is where we started. Oh, God. Ah, there's a void. Ah, there's a hole. Let me fix the hole and yeah. We'll find them. There's it, the thing with sheep are they're loving creatures. They're beautiful little level. There we go. Hi, you little pretty baby. You want to get sheared from it? Do they fight you when you get sheared? I know if you kill them, they want to hurt you. Nope. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Howdy. Howdy doody. Thank you so much for your kind, kind hospitality. Is there a... Yes! Sugar cane! This actually turned out to be really good. I'm excited because we've actually... We've gotten so much done, dude. Like, I was a little nervous that the prayer thing wasn't going to work. And, well, within retrospect, I have 34 seconds to see if it does. I'm going to make sure I have full food. And I'm just going to chill and relax. Make sure this thing actually does work. And then I'm going to break it somehow. I think the only way we're going to really get what we need is if we go into the deep abyss. We're going to have to go to the nether. We're going to have to go to the one one of the most dangerous places on the face of Minecraft Earth. Probably going to be a very, very bad, bad, bad time for us. But it'll turn out good. It's always good, right? It'll it'll work. Even if I die, it'll be good. We'll be fine. Um, I know you can't kill too many chickens, though. Because then you have to do a prayer to Cluckington. And... That just seems kind of pointless, because Cluckington was a jerk when I met him. Like, it, it, it didn't matter what I did and how many times I said sorry. Cluckington was just a bully. He just hated me. I think it may have just been, what the crap was that? It's like this thing watching me. No, it wasn't the cow. See that? What is that? Scaring the crap out of me, man. I think I'm seeing stuff. <laughs> Dang it! Don't take hearts of damage, man. Don't take hearts of damage. That's my own bad. Can I pray now? Notch. Almighty Notch. Accept my words of love. Longevity. And kindness. Give me health, bro. Give me health, bro. Almighty Notch. When I think of you, I'm pooping. It's usually when I'm using the restroom. That's why I said when I'm pooping. Now give me love, life, and longevity. 
You've given me this beautiful world to be in. Now give me something good. Do me something good. Wow, wow. Why aren't you working? I read your scrolls day and night, Notch. Are you really not going to work for me? Are you seriously not going to work for me? Do I have to... I'm done reading? Yay! Yeah! The Para Notch! The Notch! The Notch! Do you get to keep it? Oh, no. I have to wait eight minutes. Okay, but now I know exactly how to get more. Um, Lapis Lazuli is probably going to be the only thing holding us back because we're right next to an ocean. But thank you, Notch. I appreciate the heart of health, but still not good enough, you know? We're going to need to get Blaze Rod so that we can get the uh, Potion of Regeneration. And I think that that's the best way for us to survive. And then we're going to go on some insane adventures. I'm probably going to get into mining. I'm going to get some huge cave systems going. And I really want to make a house that you we all can call home. Because right now, Johnny just doesn't feel comfortable. I feel very lost where I am. I don't feel like I'm at home. But we were able to get the core basics down. I got myself a hammer. I have swords. But now it's definitely time to get ourselves fully in to the metallic age. Because right now, we are in the metallic age. Metallica! That's easy DC. I knew that. I was testing you guys. Just listen to me. Don't, 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 don't do that. Don't do that to me, man. Don't do that to me, man. Wait, did I pass my house? Wait, am I lost? No, my house is up here. Why did it show my house down there? This game, it's cray cray. This game don't even understand me, dog. This game. You ain't even playing for the team. You playing solo ball, yo. You playing solo ball. Playing that solo ball, though. All right, there's my gate. Thank you, gate. And we're safe. This area, get a good look. It's going to be different next time you guys see it. I'm going to work my butt off so that we have an awesome home that we can call home. Right now, it's just like this little place, this little pad we come to. It's our bachelor pad. But we're going to make a home. It's going to be cray-cray. We're going to do things that people ain't even saying. And we're probably going to protect ourselves because we don't have stairs. We have no way of protecting ourselves whatsoever. But that's going to be on the next episode of The Greatest War of All Time in Minecraft. Thank you guys so much for your hospitality. And as always, it's been your invisible ghost host, Mr. Johnny Too Tough. Yeah!